Hot. Good morning. This is Frida Liu. It's open for business. Now, for the, maybe there's something more for the ladies, but of course, it uh, works for the men as well. If you fancy getting your nails done in the comforts of your home, there is a solution for you. I'm here with the mother and daughter team, uh, Laila Johari and Sharina Manmohan from Nails on Wheels. Okay, so welcome, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. And uh, Laila is a uh, familiar face. You know, you went on TV for a Hello. long time. I was cooking over Kuali TV3. Ah, okay, so now this is... a. Uh, uh, another one of your businesses? Another one that um, my daughter decided to venture and I said, well, when since mum is in the business world, why not? You know, mm. something new. Okay, now, we I do hear of uh, people doing this as, as, I know, as well mm-hmm. uh, where they go to the home, but how would yours be different? Yeah. Well, basically, we are different in the sense that we're doing it full time. Mm-hmm. We do not have a shop and uh, therefore we are mobile so yes you do have other nail technicians going out to you know maybe special events and stuff like that but we're basically just doing that and that's our business that's who we are Hmm, okay mm-hmm. and how how did you come about this because you are a psychology graduate <laughs> and i know there's a lot of psychology in doing uh-huh. this <laughs> well Basically, it started when I came back from Australia. I had my acrylics, my extensions on, so I wanted to remove them. So Daddy Dearest brought me to the mall. We had to wait for so long. So, you know, when our turn came, we joked about it. Like, you know, wouldn't it be nice if we have somebody to come to the house and ha ha, we just laugh about it. Then that night over dinner, we were telling the family, you know, you know what happened today? So what do you guys think if we actually, you know, get somebody to come to the house? And they were like, Hey, why not? Okay. You know, so that's how it started. Okay, so and what were um, the learning points? Because this is about six months now, seven months mm-hmm, that you started mm-hmm. it, you know. What were some of the uh, learning experiences along the way? Okay, the preparation obviously started way before the six, seven months. And uh, to be honest, I didn't know anything about it. So I had to do some research and I attended OPI Academy and then I had to know where to get my things from. And after all that is done, then the whole, okay, so where do I get my manpower from? <laughs> <laughs> you know, so that that part was also a big part of the whole preparation process, trying to figure out, you know, where I'm going to get the manpower from. Because okay. we, we, if we are going to your house, that means we don't want to just send anybody who doesn't know anything. We want somebody with good experience, mm-hmm. you know. So that was a very interesting prep that okay. I had to go through, yeah. OPI Academy, this is mm-hmm. where? Here? Yes, yeah. it's in Mid Valley. Oh, there is an academy. <laughs> yes. I didn't know that. Yes. Yes. A- and so how did you resolve the manpower challenge? Uh, thank God for, for the parents. They had contacts and stuff like that. So we got in contact with somebody in the Philippines and uh, here, there, bang, bang and here so, we are. So you, you, you have to get work permits and yes, as well yes, for them. Yes, yes, so there's, yes. there's two of them. Yes, at the moment there's actually three and we mm-hmm. have one more coming on the way. Uh-huh. So yeah, so far that's what we have at the okay. moment. Okay, yeah. and how many uh, you know clients would you get uh, on, a, an, on an average day? On an average day, it really depends because this business is really interesting. Some days we can get up to five to ten people and some days they say, hey, um, my cousin's getting married tomorrow and it's an emergency. So at that point, we, we can have up to 20, 30, oh. you see. So it's really... In one home. Uh, exactly, in one house. <laughs> so we can't really tell how many a day. It, every day is like a surprise for me. Like, hi, can you come today? And I'm like, uh, uh, okay, <laughs> you know, so... Usually, if there's no parties or anything like that, we're looking at between 5 to 10. Mm-hmm. You know, we can't really take that many people because you got to bear in mind, we travel as well from point A to point B. So, uh-huh. we've got to give enough time to get from one location to the other. Okay. How mm-hmm. much notice, ideally, should mm-hmm. they give you? Okay. Ideally, <laughs> a day before. But okay. if it's like a big function, like, uh, you know, hands night or, you know, wedding, it, it's good Some if you can give us... Birthday yeah, things like that, yeah. A, at least a week before so we can prepare because we're looking at big volumes mm-hmm. but otherwise um, a day would be very very sufficient no really early calls or anything like that we've had a situation <laughs> where you know we've got a client that wanted us to be there at 7 a.m uh-huh. it was an emergency uh, it was an emergency <laughs> yes it's a very important yeah. <laughs> emergency and we were there we okay. went. We also had an emergency call at 9.30 at night. You uh, know, um, by the time my sister's getting married 12. tomorrow. Yeah. 
But technically, oh. the Te- hours yes. are. Technically, the hours are. First call will start at nine o'clock in the morning. Last call will be eight thirty. Eight thirty at night. Yeah. So how has Mom, Mommy Dearest being mm-hmm. in business? How have you been working together? Where do you come in and advise her? Okay. Does she listen to your advice? <laughs> well, we do have. Fights. <laughs> no, no. I mean, we believe in my family. I mean, it's a it's a family can that, that believes in business, and we do sit down at least once a week, if not as often as as possible, to to talk about what are the problems and the uh, to even give a pat on the back to mm-hmm. anyone that who have done something good. So, where do mummy dearest come into the picture? Is usually the advice on okay, listen to me. This is my. Ag- uh, after 20 odd years in the business they listen to your instinct you've got a female instinct you've got your business instincts and um, and most of the time the instincts are right mm-hmm. and uh, mummy do come with the dollars and cents <laughs> <laughs> mummy savings you know but it's a beautiful team and okay. I've enjoyed it because uh, when you make someone really happy after manicure and pedicure right you look at the smile and look at their yeah. hands or the feet and all that you've, you've done a good job and yeah. I love looking at even the whole family because we believe in giving packages and mm-hmm. most of the time the packages are bought by families right. so there's no deadline mm-hmm. you know so anyone who comes in even if if we are doing something and we've got time, the dad decides to do while mummy is waiting. And if one of the manicurists is free, go ahead. So we have seen so many happy families and uh, it's it's an amazing feeling. To okay. tell the truth. What's yeah. one advice you've given her? Hmm. Mm, so many. Look good, girl. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> The minute you are going to be stepping out of that uh, house, the door, you have to look fabulous and leave behind all your worries. Everyone has got problems. Mm -hmm. Everyone goes through challenges. But just leave it in a little small box and come back. And if you think that, you know, by then God have somehow or other helped you out with it, move on. Okay. (laughs) And I want to address the issue of safety, but we'll Mm. talk about that in just a moment. I'm here with uh, Laila Johari and Sharina Mamohan in uh, Open for Business. BFM 89.9. Blues, folk, metal. BFM 89.9. It's open for business. Good morning. This is Frida Liu. I'm here with the ladies from Nails on Wheels, uh, Sharina Mamohan and Laila Johari. And of course, they can come to your house to get your nails done and other services as well, Mm -hmm. right? What other services do you have? We also have massages and waxing. Mm, waxing, huh? Waxing. Oh, by the way, <laughs> massages for women, by women only. Only. Okay. <laughs> for now. Right. <laughs> okay, by women, for women only. Mm-hmm. And uh, so you, also you have uh, packages that people can buy, as yes. you're saying. What are your rates like? With- Our rates, it's generally 20 to 30 ringgit more than what you would get outside mm-hmm. because we also include the price of petrol and toll. Oh. So when we get to you, we don't ask for any extra. So you just pay slightly more for the convenience, okay, and the comfort actually. Uh, yeah, of course, yeah. you know, in the comfort of your home mm-hmm. and all that. That's you, you, you pay for that. Yeah. Um. You know, what do you do sometimes? You get customers who you know are late or whatever. You know, we've had situations where <laughs> the clients, you know, turn up like one and a half hours later, oh, my and um, mm. we usually, well, we are never rude, <laughs> you know, but we would explain that we had to, cancel, you know, cancel yeah. an appointment because of you and because, you know, you called us saying it's an emergency and you need us to be there, blah, blah, blah. So we usually charge a small fee for, you know, making us, di- exactly, yeah. for making us cancel. Well, for losing another customer. Mm. Yes, exactly. Mm. And they are sure. usually okay with that. Okay. You know, we don't have many of that. I mean, out of 10, there's maybe five, you know, mm. so it's not so bad. We don't experience it all the time. Okay, mm-hmm. that's a, the, the other the main thing here. Safety, mm-hmm. how do you ensure safety and you don't get all these crank calls and okay. uh, crazy? We have got crank calls, but yeah. uh, most of the time, um, all of us will tell each other whenever, let's say, Rina goes for an appointment, she'll tell us where is the, the address and uh, who are we, uh, mm-hmm. who would be she can contact with. And just in case something do, if she's late, she'll send us an SMS or uh, and give us a call. But we usually go a day or check out the address a day before the... Okay. If it's a bit really rather, you know... A- have you had the, that experience? Uh, so far, no. Mm. Thank goodness. I mean, all those crank calls that we got, I usually have that instinct. Mm. I mean, when a guy calls you and start asking crazy <laughs> questions and like do you do accent yeah, you, you know massage, and like massage and things like that and I will answer straight away like I'm sorry it's females only da 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 you know and you can tell that they're just 
playing around because yeah. they're laughing on the phone and mm. stuff like that. But otherwise, um, the clients that we've got at the moment, no hanky panky. Everything has been fine, and um, the usually the address yes. actually says yes, a lot. Tells, yeah. Okay, you know, when I see the address, I'll be like, okay, Papa, Mommy, do you know this place? And like, oh yeah, it's here, it's here, it's here. So either we drive there a Have day a earlier, yeah. you mm. know, or if for example the place is too far for us to go. Everybody will get the whole family will get an SMS from me to say this is my last address. Mm-hmm. This is where I'm going to. God forbid if anything were to happen, this was my last location. Okay. Yeah. So all these things are checked. Yeah, you know, so you can. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. There's only so much you can do. Um, and right now, in terms of uh, a payment, is it just by cash only? Most of the time, yeah, yeah. we prefer cash because mm-hmm. um, they would rather know already. They will call or some arena would just let them know before we do come. This uh, what you're gonna do. You confirm, and this is the amount. Mm-hmm. So they will usually keep the cash ready, and and uh, we do accept uh, checks, checks when it's a yeah. whole package deal because mm. it's gonna be quite a lot. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And online transfer, Maybank to you and some of the uh, local banks. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I think. Cash is is something which is still we okay, accept. Mm. And, and I guess down the road, hopefully the credit card kind of thing down the road. Down the road. Okay, so right now I'm just looking at your packages uh, mm. and and the one that you've got the the thousand five. I'm just looking at that. That's a uh, let's go full 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 circuit spa petty times twelve mm-hmm. times, right? Yeah. What happens there? Well, it's you got the whole, whole circuit. Yeah, you've got the whole <laughs> works. Basically, you've got your shaping of nails, cuticle detailing. Um, <clears throat> what do you call scrub, mask, massage, the whole Spa. work. So oh. you just sit back and enjoy. <laughs> and most of the time, people that have been, they've been calling, it is for many patties or more for the massages. Actually, we've got um, I think equally, equally yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Even, Even though for the name waxing is as well. Okay. Even for the waxing as well, because they feel that since we're already doing everything, might as well might as well mm. get all done. So you know, we actually get equal yeah. calls for everything. Exactly. Okay. Mm. And what kind of people have you been attracting? Um, in working professionals more. Uh, working professionals, a lot of families, mm-hmm. and um, we've got also quite a lot of uh, a few artists mm-hmm. who. Most of the time, when um, we are, they are already on our list of clientele. Mm. What they do These is are your friends. Eh, I'll, I'll, <laughs> <laughs> They're younger, yeah. younger artists who just love their nails before their show. Mm-hmm. So they will call her a day before and say, "Okay, we're performing, and uh, you know, so we need to get our uh, our nails, nails done. done." And sometimes those who are going for photo shoot. Right. Uh-huh. So we've got and um, family of um, yeah, quite high and uh, rich and famous clientele. Okay. Yeah. Will you be introducing other elements, makeup or whatever? Well, I am actually looking into all of those things because we do get questions Quests, about yeah. it, you know, and I think it, it it would be a very good thing to have everything in one stop. Mm-hmm. You get what I mean? So I'm also looking at makeup, hair, we're looking at facial as well. Right. You know, so anything which is doable, something that we if if we can bring it to you, yeah. Yeah. then why not? We will bring it to you. So I'm and looking into we've all got those. also calls for henna, mm-hmm. you know, especially yes. yeah, during weddings and all that. Threading, so, mm. you know, so I'm definitely looking into that. Okay, I need some done. <laughs> okay, so that's... And, and of course, now there is a Chinese New Year promotion that you're having. Yes, we have a promotion on gel, manicure and pedicure for 188 And the normal price is 230 So this goes on until a day before Chinese New Year. Oh, a day before Chinese New Year. Yes. Like everyone's having their reunion dinner. <laughs> yeah. Why not? not? All Eat right. while we get your nails done. <laughs> okay. All the best for nails and wheels. I Thank will be you. calling. Thank uh, you. Sharina. So much. <laughs> Sharina Mamohan and Laila Jahari. This is Open for Business, BFM 89.9. Thank you for listening to this podcast. To find more great interviews, go to bfm.my or find us on iTunes. BFM 89.9, The Business Station.